A beautiful light in the orchard. Just gorgeous. I've just given the yews a new bale of hay and it's different from the one they've been used to so they don't like it. <laughs> they're all abandoning it. Look at that, they're walking away from the new bale of hay. What I might do is peel the skin, the outer layer of hay away. They might appreciate it more. But I saw something interesting when I was bringing the bale of hay. I thought it was an aborted fetus. So we came back to look at it and it's not. It's a huge pile of bird poo all in one location. And this apple tree has a branch right there. And I think this might be where the resident buzzard who lives up here roosts at night because that is much too big a poo pile for a wood pigeon, the next biggest bird. So I'd say this is the resident buzzard's poo pile is right here. And it has a good view of the orchard for rodents and frogs, etc. Oh, the sun's gone in. Okay, I'm gonna go and peel the edge of the uh, hay bale out because they're obviously not interested in it. Oh no, there's a few. Okay, maybe I've been feeding them too much good hay in the uh, hay shed. Actually, there's still some in there, so they haven't finished that hay, so they're gonna go back to that hay because it's a nicer hay. <laughs> anyway, eating bits and pieces. This is, they're eating the um, celandine. That's celandine coming up. It's a yellow flower, early blooming, and it's also medicinal. It's got antibacterial properties. So, yeah, no, they'll eat that hay. There's yews already around it. It's just not as good as the other hay. Anyway, there we go. A buzzard's roost. I can only think that that's what that is. Maybe if I came up at night, except then I'd disturb the buzzard. That wouldn't be fair. But it's a perfect perch right there. But I've never seen such a huge pile, and that's... I know that's not a wood pigeon pile of poop. Look, the size of my foot next to it. That is huge. I think there's a buzzard's roost is right there. How are you, Kestrel? Look at this beautiful mushroom. Look at that. Such a beautiful orange color. And all the sheep now coming over to see what I'm looking at. <laughs> Sorry girls, you don't like my hay.
<laughs> Java, you're being nice. Oh, come on. Leave it. Java, you're bold. <laughs> Inca, leaving them alone. working way out here and didn't notice that I only had four dogs with me and then I heard a bark and I have a suspicion a certain person is in here <laughs> I did I locked you in there. <laughs> I'm sorry, Inca. I didn't know you were in there. I was in watering the plants that are in here. <laughs> oh, poor Inca Dink. Come on, pups, out. Good dogs. Well, at least she finally barked. <laughs>